Well, there's certainly a pretty good chance we've all seen the promises work when you want and make some money at home. But this week we're looking into whether or not you can really make money online. Channel 3's Roger Suzanne spoke with two money makers who get paid to do one of their favorite activities, reading. Oh man, what a view. Welcome to beautiful Aruba. For most of us, it's a vacation destination, but for one lucky Connecticut woman, it's also her office this week. I've been here two days. I've already done six hours of work, so yes, I am working here. Linda Schifrin lives in Berlin, but can work anywhere, anytime, thanks to her new job as a professional proofreader. And I like my boss. <laughs> Linda laughs now, but she takes this new path very seriously. After decades toiling away in the corporate world, Linda wanted more flexibility, and she knew her skill set and, well, passion would make editing a natural fit. I'm one of those people, but I silently correct people's grammar. I, don't, I try not to do it rudely. <laughs> Perhaps you've seen ads like this promoting professional proofreading on social media. But Linda just bids for jobs on two sites, Freelancer.com and Upwork. And there are weeks when it's crazy and all my clients show up at once and <laughs> you know how it goes. So the big question, how much can you make? Linda sometimes works for as little as 20 bucks an hour for a project she finds fun, like this book that was just published. But for denser material, she'll bill up to $60 an hour. But you have to be patient. It takes a while to get a foothold. You can tailor the job to how much time you have. Elizabeth Wigner earns even more money in her specialized role as a courtroom transcription proofreader. She's paid directly by court stenographers and says her days are filled by reading true crime for as much as a buck ten per page. I just built up my business and said goodbye to my boss and started doing it all on my own and it's been I haven't looked back. It's been wonderful. Elizabeth says many of her friends who are also busy moms even get a little jealous. When you get to quit your job from like corporate life um, and working for others and you get to start proofreading from home, people start asking, how did you do this? So now Elizabeth teaches others how to proofread transcripts. She says, although you don't need any certifications, her online course, which costs about a thousand bucks, will walk you through the technical skills you should know and help you book clients. Every single one who has put in the work has gotten clients and made money and done a wonderful job. Elizabeth says you can make up to $50,000 a year full time, but it's also a great side hustle. Both she and Linda agree the best perk of the job is their boss. Who's better than me? <laughs> if you're willing to learn and put in the work, it is just unbelievably rewarding. Roger Susanen, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. All right.